SpaceX has just pulled the curtain back on their next big leap in rocket technology. The massive Starship Block 2 booster. This isn't just a booster, it's a towering testament to human ingenuity. With jaw-dropping size, cutting-edge Raptor 3 engines, and a design optimized for unprecedented thrust, this booster is set to redefine what's possible in space exploration. And that's not all new developments at Starbase and Cape Canaveral are ramping up the excitement as SpaceX builds the infrastructure for the future of interplanetary travel. Plus, Rocket Lab is throwing down the gauntlet with their ambitious neutron rocket, turning up the heat in the competition. SpaceX has done it again, pushing the boundaries of innovation. This time their focus was on recovering Ship 31. And while it wasn't a complete success, it was far from a failure. Imagine this, a Starship upper stage splashes down in the Indian Ocean, marking the culmination of meticulous planning and execution. SpaceX has been working closely with the Australian government and U.S. regulators, ensuring everything was by the book. In the days leading up to the event, the ship Limitless, a loyal workhorse for SpaceX, prepared the recovery site. This ship has a history of supporting Starship splashdowns, including those from flights 4 and 5. But this time, its mission was more ambitious. Alongside the Barton Renegade, the task was clear. Recover Ship 31 and its valuable components. However, upon impact with the water, Ship 31 tipped over, breaking into two massive sections, the payload bay and the tank section. Despite the setback, all was not lost. The tank section managed to stay afloat, allowing SpaceX to salvage valuable parts. The recovery team spent days stripping the floating debris, retrieving everything from heat tiles to composite overwrapped pressure vessels. COPVs. Imagine a bag full of heat tiles. Yes, a literal bag filled with the protective armor that endured the fiery descent. These recovered components are now on their way to Starbase for analysis, ready to provide critical insights into Starship's performance under real-world conditions. This recovery isn't just about salvaging materials. It's about learning, improving, and evolving. The heat tiles in particular are a goldmine of information. How much did they degrade? Were they effective under extreme temperatures? Every detail counts as SpaceX fine-tunes the Starship design. And speaking of design improvements, let's talk about the future of Starship boosters. Elon Musk recently confirmed that the first Block 2 booster will fly before the end of 2025. These new boosters are not just taller, they're stronger, more efficient, and armed with Raptor 3 engines. The Raptor 3 boasts an incredible 280 tons of thrust, a significant leap from the 230 tons of its predecessor. Picture this, a booster with nearly 10,000 tons of thrust. That's the equivalent of 14 Falcon 9S firing simultaneously. The Block 2 booster is a marvel of engineering, designed to handle the increasing demands of Starship's ambitious missions. And guess what? We may have already caught a glimpse of its first segments. Recent photos reveal new booster components with noticeable design changes. Could this be the start of the Block 2 era? It seems likely, and it's thrilling to witness this evolution. While SpaceX innovates in the skies, they're also revolutionizing the ground infrastructure. Pad B at Starbase is undergoing significant upgrades, incorporating lessons learned from Pad A's challenges. This isn't just a tweak. It's a complete overhaul to withstand the fury of 35 Raptor engines firing multiple times a day. And here's the kicker. Similar work is happening at Cape Canaveral, signaling SpaceX's intent to replicate their success across multiple sites. In fact, new launch mount parts have been spotted at Cape Canaveral, identical to those at Starbase. This marks a major step forward as SpaceX builds a more robust and standardized launch infrastructure. The implications? Faster turnaround times, more frequent launches, and a giant leap toward the company's goal of making spaceflight as routine as air travel. 
But SpaceX isn't the only player making headlines. Rocket Lab's Neutron rocket is shaping up to be a serious contender in the space industry. Designed as a reusable medium-lift vehicle, Neutron combines innovation with simplicity. Its enclosed second stage and clamshell fairing are just a few of the features that set it apart. Recent tests have shown promising results, and Rocket Lab's rapid development pace suggests we could see Neutron in action soon. The competition doesn't end there. The small satellite launch market is heating up, with companies vying for dominance. Rocket Lab's Electron has emerged as a leader, but the landscape is ever-changing. Some players, like Astra and Virgin Orbit, have faced setbacks, while others, like Firefly Aerospace, are pushing forward. This competitive environment fuels innovation, driving the industry toward a future where space is more accessible than ever. Looking ahead, the next phase of the Starship program promises to be even more exciting. From the development of specialized variants like the tanker ship and lunar lander, to the refinement of existing designs, SpaceX is setting the stage for a new era of exploration. And with advancements in ground infrastructure and rocket technology, the possibilities are limitless. As we wrap up this incredible journey through the latest space advancements, one thing is clear. We're living in a golden age of exploration. SpaceX continues to push the boundaries with ambitious recovery efforts, cutting-edge booster designs, and rapid infrastructure upgrades. Meanwhile, competitors like Rocket Lab are proving that innovation isn't exclusive to the giants, driving the industry toward greater efficiency and accessibility. Every milestone we witness, whether it's recovering parts of Ship 31, glimpsing the future of Block 2 boosters, or observing the rise of Neutron, brings us one step closer to making space a part of our daily lives. The dream of a multi-planetary future is no longer a distant vision. It's happening right now, in real time. With all these groundbreaking developments, here's the big question. Do you think SpaceX's rapid innovation will solidify their dominance in space exploration, or could rising competitors like Rocket Lab eventually steal the spotlight? Let us know your thoughts in the comments below. Don't forget to hit that like button, smash subscribe for more jaw-dropping space updates, and join us as we embark on a cosmic journey like never before.